Museum on the Seam in Jerusalem is a socio-political museum, the first of its kind in Israel, which presents contemporary art at its best. The exhibitions on display take the visitor on a journey through expressions of difficult reality, exposing violations of human rights and freedoms, guiding the visitor to the seam lines between the individual and the state. The establishment of the museum was, for me, a natural way to express my vision, to encourage dialogue through art and raise questions of importance for a universal discussion, and in this way to make a modest contribution. At the same time, to advance thoughts of equality and sense of mutual respect within Israeli society and, of course, between us and our neighbors. The selection of artists and works of art is a fascinating curatorial process that seeks a careful composition in the face of the reality that exists outside the walls of the museum. Exposure of these works to the eyes of the viewer encourages dialogue and search for solutions for a better world. <laughs> Through works of art by leading artists from around the world who work with a sense of mission, the museum expresses the voice of those whose rights have been taken from them and who have been pushed onto the sidelines of freedom and liberty. The museum is situated across from the walls of the old city of Jerusalem, bordering impoverished communities and extremely religious neighborhoods, on the crossroad between East and West and between Israelis and Palestinians. The charged past of the museum building emphasizes even more the gaps between fear and hope, between poverty and abundance, between desire for peace and fear of violence and aggression.
The bullet-scarred facade is a mirror of the reality we are living in, and the exhibitions are an attempt to encourage visitors to re-examine their political and ideological positions while highlighting what we share rather than what divides us. The museum was selected by the New York Times as one of the 29 most impressive art institutions in the world. And by National Geographic as one of the 10 most fascinating museums.